So what are you going to do when you retire anyways? You going to sit around a bar all day watching ESPN classics? I'll be in Tuscany. Oh, right. So you'll be sitting in a wine bar all day, forced to watch international soccer matches. I'm still young enough to do a lot of great things. Look at Ramirez. He retired and had a whole second life that he loved. Yeah, sure. Could happen. But why? I mean, do you still love your job? You still good at it? Yes and yes. You paying attention to me? Are you a cranky bastard with a bad back? Do I take credit for your police work? Would I shoot you in a second if I thought I'd get me a new partner with silky skin and legs that went on for days? Look, look, we've been through this before. I promised Elizabeth. Qui bestia va a Roma? Bestia retorna. I'm studying up. Because what's important to you is important to me. What does it mean? He who goes to Rome by foot returns a fool. The point being? You promise your wife that you guys were going to go to Tuscany, right? Together. Only she's not here now. And yes, you know, you've got this house that you bought. But that's not what she ever wanted. You, alone in Italy, wearing a straw hat, linen pants, I mean, yikes. So, look, if what you really want to do is retire, then do it. But if you're doing this out of some sense of obligation to her, I'm here to tell you don't, OK? Because even I know, man, all she'd ever want is for you to do what's best. To be happy. I, I just hate to see you go to Tuscany by foot, only to return a fool. I wasn't planning on walking. Don't ruin the poetry. This your way of saying you'd be lost without me? No. That's just my way of purchasing a below-market Tuscan villa from a desperate seller. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What's he doing here? Oh, he's just a super. Oh, no. I meant him. You said... Yeah, I said your child didn't need to come between us. Look, it, it doesn't matter. No big deal. We'll just, you know, you can get someone to look after him. There is no one. Maybe a family or... No, we don't have any family here. Right. Okay. That's okay. I'm his family. It's okay. It's okay. I'll just arrange a nanny service. It's... I'm not leaving him. I think if you just gave him a chance, he'd really like oh, him. Oh, no. Uh-huh. Really? Yeah. Ew, he opened his mouth. No, I'm sorry. It's just... I can't help it. Goodbye, Jordan. So if you compare your sales to my sales, you can see we have some work to do. But that's OK, because that's what learning's all about. We're going to have a foothold in the North American market, and that's why we're here. So Ted. Ted! Don't make me confiscate yours, too. <laughs> <laughs> Teddy. Kevin. I'd like you to play tennis with me tonight. What? OK. What? Yeah. Tom McCraney's getting that thing on his neck taken off. Thank God. Ugh. Ah. Seen it? Ugh. Looks like a bloody cauliflower. Mm. 
Can you handle a racket? No. Great. I'll have Tina send over the details. Don't let me down, Ted. I won't. Wow. That's a nice frame. Hey. Hey. Sorry I'm late. Uh, how's with Chloe's mom? Oh, well, yeah. How's that going? Oh, well, sex is great. And uh, I'm pretty sure her name is Caitlin. <laughs> or Catherine. Hmm. Anyway, what'd you get, Jessica? Oh, no, um. Edible underwear. Wow. So, what do they taste like? I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not going to taste them without her. Really? I mean, what if you don't like how they taste? <laughs> you know, you don't want to be in that situation and say, yuck. I did get a three pack. <laughs> Just. So? It's not bad. Tastes a little like a perverted fruity lunch snack. Oh. Do, do, do I get a taste? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mine's raspberry. I love raspberry. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs>